Welcome to today's edition of Crypto Corner at InvestorIdeas.com, news on what's driving the cryptocurrency market. This podcast was sponsored by cryptocurrency payment technology Flip, a creation of FitPay Inc., a leading provider of cutting-edge payment technology and a subsidiary of NextID, traded on the NASDAQ under the ticker symbol NXTD. Next ID is a provider of healthcare devices as well as payment credential management and authentication platform services. Learn more about how to order Flip at fliptopay.com. And Crypto Corner is also sponsored by Genesis Blockchain Technologies or GBT. GBT is a powerful cryptocurrency centralized decentralized exchange which will include a broad range of services and benefits from cryptocurrency and blockchain markets development while avoiding complications and risks arising from cryptocurrency ownership, transfer, and exchange. You can download the Genesis Exchange and Wallet app at Google Play and on the Apple App Store. Learn more at www.mygenesis.io. Japanese electronics giant Sony has developed a cryptocurrency hardware wallet, according to a recent press release. The company's Computer Sciences Laboratories division, Sony CSL, has designed a physical wallet that utilizes IC card technology, which stores users' private keys. The wallet is described as small, portable, and useful when compared to other existing alternatives that require a USB connection. The release also indicates the wider potential of the hardware wallet. Quote, this IC card type cryptocurrency hardware wallet technology not only manages the private keys used for cryptocurrency transactions, but also manages private keys used for other purposes, such as those for permitting the use of personal information using blockchain technology. It is an infrastructure technology with multiple possible applications. End quote. And Japan's Financial Services Agency, or FSA, country's financial watchdog, is considering placing leverage caps on margin trading of cryptocurrencies, according to Nikkei Asian Review. Currently, there is no such cap, though some exchanges voluntarily cap at 25 times the deposit. Out of the 16 FSA-registered operators in the country, seven currently provide margin trading. The report indicates that in fiscal 2017, 80% of Japan's crypto transactions were conducted through margin trading. The FSA plans to discuss potential legislation with a panel of experts. And South Korea's Financial Services Commission, or FSC, has released documents warning against investment into cryptocurrency. The warning details how crypto funds are in violation of the country's Capital Markets Act, in that they have neither been registered or approved for fundraising from the FSC. Spanish publication ABC.es reports that Spain has enacted legislation compelling both companies and individuals to disclose their crypto holdings. The country's Minister of Finance, Maria Jesus Montero, explained that even citizens with holdings abroad must report them, quote, It is stated as mandatory that people and companies inform the tax agency about this operation. Likewise, Spaniards with currency abroad must also report their possessions in Bitcoin and others in the annual declaration of goods abroad. That does it for today's Crypto Corner. If you would like to be a guest or sponsor for this podcast, contact InvestorIdeas.com. Investor Ideas reminds all listeners to read our disclaimers and disclosures on the InvestorIdeas.com website. This podcast is not an endorsement to buy products, services, or securities. Investors are reminded all investment involves risk and possible loss in investment. To hear more InvestorIdeas.com podcasts, please visit InvestorIdeas.com slash audio. And a reminder, you can also hear our podcasts on Spotify, iTunes, TuneIn, Stitcher, Spreaker.com, iHeartRadio.com, and Google Play Music. For disclosure purposes, Next ID is a PR news and social media featured company on InvestorIdeas.com.